Hello everyone, in this video we're going to look at the new Microsoft Defender app for Windows. The Microsoft Defender app is a security product designed to protect Windows devices as well as phones including Android and iPhone and Mac OS computers. The company has been working on this product for a number of months and it is now available as a preview through the Microsoft Store for users in the United States. And no, Microsoft is not planning to charge you money for the Microsoft Defender antivirus that comes built in into Windows 11 and Windows 10. I think that will remain as it is today. However, the Microsoft Defender app is a new offering meant to provide a unified dashboard to manage your online security for a family of devices, including for those running Windows 11, Windows 10, Mac OS, iPhone, Android, and more. Of course, as long as they are connected with the same Microsoft account. To install it, you need to get it from the Microsoft Store. So we're going to do that. And this is a page for the application. And installation is as simple as any other app from the Microsoft Store. We're going to click Install. And then we're going to click Open. And this is the first splash. And I'm going to sign in with the same Microsoft account that I have connected to this computer. You need to accept the terms to continue like always. And then we're going to click Next. The app offers real-time notifications, security tips, and recommended steps to protect your device from hackers and malicious code. You can see a quick overview that this computer is protected because it's using the Microsoft Defender antivirus that comes built in into Windows 11. And if we want to see more details, we click this button right here. And as you can see, we get information about the last scan and other different information. If you want to see even more details, you get this button right here that opens the, the Windows Security app so you can customize the settings and view other details. Since this application is meant to be a centralized place to control all the security for your devices, we get the other devices tab. And here, that's where you're going to find all the other devices connected with the same Microsoft account using Microsoft Defender. I don't have another device here, so I'm going to click the Add New Device option. And as you can see, I get this link that I can use to install the application and connect it to the to the surface. So let me just switch to another computer. And we're going to install the application on this Windows 11 machine. And it is all the same process. Now we're going to switch back. And as you can see, now we get the information about the other computer that we added to Microsoft Defender. Just remember that the application is still in beta, so there are things that are not working correctly. Uh, for example, in order for me to see this device right here listed, I have to actually pause the video and restart the computer to actually refresh the application. And as you can see, we get some defects on the user interface that we don't see and even like the buttons to maximize or minimize don't render correctly yet. If you no longer want to have the device on the dashboard, you can simply click the delete button to remove it. However, it's not going to get removed completely. It will take 90 days to actually remove it from the service, but you can click, I guess you can click the delete button again and that will remove the device from the account. Just remember that this is not the actual antivirus or any firewall or anything like that. This is just an application to manage the security of all your devices already running an antivirus. And more specifically, you're going to see more information if you're running the Microsoft Defender antivirus. And using this offering, you will be able to add or remove devices easily up to four devices. The preview is available without a subscription, but all the devices need to be using the same Microsoft account. But this is only during the uh, preview period. After the Microsoft Defender app becomes available, you will need a Microsoft 365 family or personal subscription in order to access this application. And that's it. That is the first look at the new Microsoft Defender app in this case, the app for Windows 11 and Windows 10. Remember to like the video, share it, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.